And after the last game, you, you spoke about the defensive issues you guys had against the Bulls. Did you see some of those same issues tonight, or or, or was it different problems against the Celtics? Nah, it was, uh, I wouldn't say uh, different problems, but, you know, the thing about it, we got to be more connected. Uh, and that's offensively and defensively. Uh, I feel like we just need to be more connected. And, you know, it's the start of the season. That's no excuse, but <clears throat> everybody's catching the rhythm, trying to figure it out. Pam, all the guys are saying that, that lack of communication, lack of being connected, like what can fix that? Uh, communicate. <laughs> uh, I mean, guys getting out their comfort zone. You know, we all come from the summer where – you know, we play pickup, uh, we play in pro leagues, and, you know, defense matters to a certain extent. So there's no communication, so you build that habit. Uh, now we just got to get out of that habit, uh, build a new one, um, and that's communicating, everybody clicking on all cylinders, uh, and everybody being in sync. Ben, what was your frustration level when you got your fourth foul and the run kind of slipped away from you guys in that third quarter? Uh my frustration was uh, it wasn't because of that foul. It was just, you know, I felt like he gave me three of my four, and that was that was that was my my frustration, uh, you know. But I feel like I let that dictate, you know, the swing of the game, um, and that's on me. Uh, and he got me out of twenty five hundred. Could have bought my chef's child an iPad or something. <laughs> yeah, but now now my money go to a charity. I don't even know where it's going. Bam, so far nobody on the team really seems all that concerned with the offense, but understanding that Boston will take certain things away through two games, are you guys getting the shots that you want? Yeah, I feel like all our shots was in, you know, each player's wheelhouse. Uh, you know, I feel like everybody who, who was taking shots, they were falling. Um, you know, I feel like it's more the defensive side. Uh, we got to get back to that mentality of trying to hold teams under 100. Bam, you guys speak about the defense uh, not being good enough through these first couple of games. Uh, I'm just thinking about, in general, the way that um, you guys were able to get, you know, you, you spoke about how all the mid-range shots and all the shots that they were giving you, those were the shots that, you know, you guys took. It happened a lot uh, in the Eastern Conference Finals as well. Um, how much of it is just taking the shots that the Celtics are giving you? How much of it is just trying to, you know, figure out a rhythm for you guys? And um, is there a balance to that, to taking all the shots they give you versus others? Uh, definitely a balance. You know, everybody wants to be aggressive, but you know, we got to be smart with our, our shot selection. Uh, like I said, I feel like everybody who was taking shot in, who was taking shots tonight was in the wheelhouse. Uh, I feel like those are shots. Everybody shoots in practice. Everybody shoots in uh, shoot around, one-on-one, -on -one, whatever it may be. Um, so it's, it's really not our offense. Um, I feel like 104 points can win a game. You know, I feel like it's the other side we need to really – lock in on. Bam, Gabe had a, a, a nice finish to the game. Now, now that he's been through the fire of the playoffs, so to speak, have you noticed anything different in him or in his approach this year? Definitely more aggressive. He's definitely got comfortable in his role. Uh, and he's, he's becoming, you know, a great backup for Kalo. Uh and he brings a different dynamic to the game. He picks up 94 feet. You know, he has that that dog mentality that we all love. Uh, as you've seen in the, in the stretch where he was doing it on both sides. You um you really got going, especially early on, right away, hitting those shots in the mid range, going at it all offensively. Is that what did you specifically work on in terms of that area of your game this summer? And is that something you're hoping to expand upon as the season goes on? Uh, I mean, me, those shots are in my wheelhouse. Uh, you know, Coach speaks about being efficient, and 
you know, that was the biggest thing for me this offseason, just being efficient and being consistent with my shots. Black Lives Matter, people.